is nuclear fake. You know? I mean, it's like, you know, it's been people talking about it for a while. They're like, nukes are fake. But I'm just going, I don't know. I don't know. Because um, I'm a hairdresser. Well, I used to work as a hairdresser. I do I do a few people's hair. Every now and then. But look, I, I've had people that were former mili- or in the military or former military who had worked on nuclear submarines. And all of them had... Well, very thin hair. Like, the, it was super thin. Like, it didn't make sense kind of thin. Like, it wasn't male pattern bald, but the, the whole head, thin, thin. Very similar to what Lenny's hair is like, which is what I told him. It looks like he worked on a nuclear sub. We don't know why his hair is like this, but at any rate, he's on the iodine. He's on the Lugols. Finally. So that's all I got to say about that. To the naysayers that say, no, nuclear is not real. And a lot of these people have had their thyroids removed because they were... So, I, I don't know. I think that um, I think that they lie about a lot. I believe that they they may be pumping up the fear porn about nuclear stuff. It may be that some nuclear isotopes are super dangerous and a whole bunch of the rest of them aren't, but they're telling us they are or that they can do certain things with them that they can't, but they want us to think that they can, like nuclear bombs. I, I don't know. All I got to say is I don't know. It's just like what people say, the Holocaust didn't happen. No, 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 I don't I don't think it didn't happen. I think it happened. I think that we're lied to about the details. About why and how and who and what they really meant and what was actually going on. Because the script has been flipped on me my entire life, so why would it not be flipped on the entirety of history? I, you know what I mean? They just want us to think things, so they're like, well, this happened, this happened, this happened, this happened. So let's create a story that makes it plausible. And then they do. And then they tell us it's history and they write it in the history books. That's my thoughts. But I think it's something, and you know, I think the details are always entirely different than what we've been told. Happy New Year. I got a, an interesting year coming up. And see if I can make videos worth interesting at all to watch or listen to. I'm so, I'm so bo- I feel like I'm so boring. I'm so boring. I'm just some boring grandma. All right. Happy New Year. Peace out, YouTube. Love y'all for listening to me. Thank you so much for listening and carrying me through all of last year, which was an, an incredible psychological thrill ride of um, healing and recovery from a lifetime of delusions, of believing things that just were simply not true. And trying to make life fit. And I was just, I was crumbling. I was dying inside. Radical acceptance about everything. That's it. Because life is flying by and you cannot help what they think or whatever. Whether it's your parents, your kids, your neighbor, it, just, your dog. You just live it. Love it, live it. And that's it. Happy New Year. Bam. We're out.